When Gabby Bell learned there was a naked photo of her circulating on the internet, her body turned cold. The YouTube influencer had never posed for the image, which showed her standing in a field without clothes. She knew it must be fake. But when Bell, 26, messaged a colleague asking for help removing the image he told her there were nearly 100 fake photos scattered across the web mostly housed on websites known for hosting porn generated by artificial intelligence. They were taken down in July, Bell said, but new images depicting her in graphic sexual situations have already surfaced. I felt yucky and violated, Bell said in an interview. Those private parts are not meant for the world to see because I have not consented to that. So it's really strange that someone would make images of me. Artificial intelligence is fueling an unprecedented boom this year in fake pornographic images and videos. It's enabled by a rise in cheap and easy-to-use AI tools that can undress people in photographs, analyzing what their naked bodies would look like and imposing it into an image, or seamlessly swap a face into a pornographic video. On the top 10 websites that host AI-generated porn photos, fake nudes have ballooned by more than 290% since 2018, according to Genevieve O, an industry analyst. These sites feature celebrities and political figures such as New York Representative Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez alongside ordinary teenage girls, whose likenesses have been seized by bad actors to incite shame, extort money or live out private fantasies. Victims have little recourse. There's no federal law governing deepfake porn, and only a handful of states have enacted regulations. President Biden's AI executive order issued Monday recommends, but does not require, companies to label AI-generated photos, videos and audio to indicate computer-generated work. Meanwhile, Legal scholars warn that AI fake images may not fall under copyright protections for personal likenesses, because they draw from data sets populated by millions of images. This is clearly a very serious problem, said Tiffany Lee, a law professor at the University of San Francisco. The advent of AI images comes at a particular risk for women and teens, many of whom aren't prepared for such visibility. A 2019 study by Sensity AI, a company that monitors deepfakes, found 96% of deepfake images are pornography, and 99% of those photos target women. It's now very much targeting girls, said Sophie Maddox, a researcher and digital rights advocate at the University of Pennsylvania. Young girls and women who aren't in the public eye. On September 17, Miriam al-Adib Mendiri was returning to her home in southern Spain from a trip when she found her 14-year-old daughter distraught. Her daughter shared a nude picture of herself. Look, mom. What have they done to me? Al-Adib Mendiri recalled her daughter saying. She never posed nude.